This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello there, I'm Virginia Chow with this ABC 10 News update. An SUV going up in flames in the middle of an Allied Gardens neighborhood after the driver crashed into a parked car. Police say a woman was leaving a home on 50th Street just before one this morning when she drove into that car. Her SUV then caught fire. Police say she grabbed a toddler out of the back seat and then just walked away, but a neighbor followed her. Firefighters put out the flames while police tracked the woman down. They say DUI was not a factor in this crash. A power outage in Del Mar forcing the city council to put some important decisions on hold. The outage happened during a city council meeting last night. One of the biggest measures they were going to vote on involved building affordable housing units on the Del Mar fairgrounds. They were set to vote on whether to hire a group to provide economic studies for that project. They're planning to meet again this week. San Diego State's new Aztec Stadium reaching another milestone. The university announcing the naming rights for the football stadium's peer overview. The piers, as it's called, is a section that extends over the bowl seating area, and it will offer standing room for events at the stadium. They say it was inspired by the San Diego coastline. The naming rights announcement today marks the first founding partnership at Aztec Stadium. Let's talk about this weather. We started out really foggy, Vanessa, right. but things are looking up. Right, a lot of those low level clouds are subsiding. We're just now hanging out with high level clouds that are spanning from the coastline to the valleys. And that'll pretty much be the story as we progress through your afternoon. Meanwhile, clouds are going to thicken overnight and we'll wake up to another foggy start as we look ahead to your Wednesday morning. Today's highs are going to be about 10 degrees cooler than yesterday. A lot of us already seeing cool temperatures this afternoon. We're in the mid to upper 60s along the beaches and we'll top out in the low 70s through the inland valleys, 60s in the mountains and upper 80s in the deserts. Coastal highs are going to stay in this trend of the mid to upper 60s for the next several days with the exception of the latter part of the weekend. That's when we see a little bit of a warm up. Up. We'll uh, top out close to 70 degrees Sunday, and that will lead us into the start of next week as well. Virginia. All righty. Thank you, Vanessa. For the latest news, weather, and traffic, just go to 10news.com, or you can download our free app from your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Virginia Shaw.